Hello guys, welcome to Helpful Solutions and let's begin. Of course for tablets and everything, you can just use these app settings and go here and do chats. And yes, this will enable a split screen normally, but since not everybody uses a tablet and most of you guys use it on your phones, I will show you a way you can even do on your phone. Of course to do it, I need to go into my settings. In settings, there will be an option to enable split screen and for some it's in the extra settings, it's in the additional settings, for me it's in the special features right here. But of course if your phone doesn't say special or anything similar, you can go into the search bar that's up there and write split screen or just say splits. Then we will choose split screen and as you can see there is an opinion called three finger split screen. You will be able to swipe up three fingers to enter a split screen mode and of course then you will just select another task and just add them to the split screen. Of course if it's not enabled make sure to enable it right now as you can see it's not enabled but of course I will enable it back for the video's sake and now we will go try that on WhatsApp. As you can see I'm back in WhatsApp and now I will use my three fingers on the screen to just like as you can see it just went all the way up in the screen but how will I get it back because it's too up there I can't use it for that I need to choose another app to actually make sure it's split screen that's why the screen opened up I will choose Google Play Store for simplicity's sake as you can see right now it's both Google Play Store and my WhatsApp and I can use both of them together Let's go even search, of course there is my keyboard here, let's move that a little and do WhatsApp. As you can see I can use both my WhatsApp and my Google Play Store at the same time with this feature. But how do I close it when I want to actually get rid of the dual screens? And of course since they are conjoined together and they are part of a group, I can use this lock button and to see go to back to it. And when you close one of the apps, you will be able to get rid of both of them. That way I will just go into apps. As you can see, they cannot be closed. Even the close all button won't close them. They'll close the other stuff. So I will go into my WhatsApp, touch it once and then use my go back button until my WhatsApp fully closes and all I have left is Google Play Store. But yes guys, that was basically it and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to give us a like and maybe subscribe to our channel, Savvy Professor. In any other case, we hope to see you in the next video as well. Have a great day and goodbye.